as we said previously, number of teeth in adult is 32. The number of teeth in each, in, in, in each jaw is 16. We have our jaw and lower jaw. As we see now in the upper jaw, how many teeth present? Yes, 16. 16 teeth present in the upper jaw. And the lower jaw also have 16 teeth. Okay, so number of teeth in adult is, yes, 32. Okay, let's start to learn about kind of teeth. We have three types of teeth in the upper jaw and the lower jaw. Incisor, canine, and molars. Incisor, four in each jaw. Four in each jaw. Function of it, cutting. Incisors, four, four, cutting. Four, four, cutting. Again, incisors, four, four, cutting. Okay, this is this is on the diagram. Incisors, where in the upper jaw, here and here, there is two. And another two, how many incisors? One, two, three, four. Four, that's right. Okay, four, four, cutting. Okay. The second type, canine. Two in each jaw. The function, four, tearing. Let's see in, uh, on, sorry, on the diagram. Canine. Canine, where? Yes. This and in the opposite side, this. One and two. Two. Two in each jaw. For what? Tearing. Okay, two for tearing. Canine, two for tearing. And molars. Ten in each jaw. For grinding. Ten in each jaw for grinding. Where? Ten molars. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Five here and the opposite side, five. Five and five equal ten. Ten in each jaw for grinding. Okay, incisors, four for cutting. Canine, two for tearing. Molars, ten for grinding. Okay, that's the kinds of teeth. We have how many types? Three incisors, canine, and molars. Four to ten. Four to ten cutting, tearing, grinding. Okay? That is a component of what? Of the mouse. We have, as we said previously, the mouse contain teeth, tongue, and salivary gland. If we open our mouse in the mirror, we will see what? Teeth, tongue, and as we know, yes, there is also a salivary gland, three pairs of salivary glands. Teeth, as we learned now. Then, let's learn about the tongue. The tongue. Function of the tongue. Helps food swallowing by mixing food with saliva. First, swallowing. Second, it moves the food around inside the mouse cavity. Moves the food around inside the mouse cavity. We can put line under moves. Okay. Firstly, swallowing moves the food in the mouse cavity. Three, responsible for testing food. Testing. It's the main word. Swallowing moves the food, of course, inside the mouse cavity. Responsible for also what? Tasting. Okay, that's what the function of the tongue. And we have also in the mouse cavity the salivary glands. Salivary glands. Three pairs of salivary glands 
open in the mouse cavity. Its function, it converts starch into sugar. Sugar is a simple substance. Okay, let's learn about again its function. Saliva, which secreted by salivary glands, contain digesting substances called enzymes that digest starch into sugar. Sugar what? Yes, yeah, simple substance. Okay, we have starch converted into simple substance, sugar, by the action of saliv saliva enzymes. Saliva enzymes which secreted by the salivary glands. Okay, salivary glands secreted what now? Yes, saliva. Salivary glands secreted what? Saliva. Action of saliva converts starch into several simple substances. Yes, which is sugar. Starch into sugar by the action of saliva enzymes. So, we can say function of the mouse are Number one, cutting, grinding by teeth. Cutting and degrading food by teeth. Number two, digestion of starch into sugar. Digestion of starch into sugar. And that, that's the function of the mouse. Okay, we now discussed with each other the component of the mouse. In the second session we will follow the passage of the food in the digestive canal. Thank you.